trying to do to me, huh? I, I don't know what you're talking don't, about, Ethan. Don't play dumb with me. You know damn well what I'm talking about. You got Lawrence Grant to rescind my job offer, didn't you? Who is Lawrence Grant? Teresa, stop lying to me. I found this on the floor of Lawrence Grant's office. And don't you dare tell me that this isn't yours because I gave it to you after the Lethal was born. And this charm right here, I added after Jane was born. Isn't that a coincidence? You know what? You want some tea? Teresa! Oh. Admit it. Admit it. You either bribed him or you threatened him not to hire me. Is that what he said? No. Actually, what he told me was some lame excuse that the New York office wasn't busy enough to justify bringing me on. However, when I called the New York office, I found out, well, they've never been busier. So he lied to me, just like you are lying to me right now. Yep, I am lying to you, Ethan. Um, I contacted Lawrence Grant, and I convinced him to withdraw his offer. And don't ask me to apologize, because I am not the least bit sorry. Well, I won't. But here's what you're going to do. You're going to call Lawrence Grant, and you're going to make this right. You're going to tell him to forget about your little visit, so he will hire me. No. No? No. You're not going to work for Lawrence Grant. You're not going to work for anyone else. The only place you're going to work is right here at Crane Industries with me. So, you and Maya were hanging out at school. Uh, well, I, I, I wouldn't exactly phrase it like that, but... Was it love at first sight? <laughs> Did you fight with Maya the way you fought with me in the beginning? Where the hell do you get off telling me what I'm going to do? I am my own man. I am not your puppet, Teresa. I know. You are strong and independent and tops at what you do, which is why I want you back here at Crane Industries. You're insane. You are insane. Just because you sabotaged my working for Lawrence Grant doesn't mean I'll stop looking for a job out of town. I'm going to find something. I'm going to find anything that'll take me away from you and your sick obsession for me. I know you don't mean that. You know what? Ethan, you love me so much that you're afraid if you stay here and work with me that you will leave Gwen. Isn't that why you're trying to find a work outside of Harmony? Isn't it, Ethan? Because you know that you cannot trust yourself to stay in a loveless marriage with your wife when being near me would remind you of what we could have together. I love my wife. I love Gwen. Not the way you love me. I am not... <laughs> I'm not getting into this with you again. I'm walking out that door and I'm going to find a job outside of this town. Fine, Ethan. Why don't you go try and find a new job, but I'll tell you this, you'll be wasting your time. Because no matter where you go, I will be there to bribe and threaten and blackmail every single person interested in hiring you until no one will touch you with a 10-foot pole. in this way. I can't believe it. I don't, I don't want to fight with you. Okay? I, I want to work with you. I want to be with you. And you think making me feel, I don't know, impotent and powerless uh, is a way to win me back? It's a way to make me leave Gwen? I got news for you, Teresa. It's not working. I don't want to make you feel any less of a man, Ethan. I just, I want you to see reason. You know, you are more of a match for Alistair than I thought, because here you are trying to trap me into doing something that you want. And what you want, Ethan. You have always dreamed of running Crane Industries. Not like this, Teresa. Not with you dictating my life to me. I'm not gonna bow to your whims. And do you think that this is a whim of mine, Ethan? You and me being together is what I've always wanted, is what I've lived for my entire life. You are the first slot Every morning, you are my last thought every night. You are my past, my present, my future, and I will not stop. I cannot stop until we are finally a family with Jane and little Ethan. <laughs>